There is the need for professionals in the built environment to form strong advocacy against quackery and sharp practices. The tide of incessant building collapse in the country must be stemmed. This formed part of the submission of stakeholders at the 13th edition of the Lagos Architect Forum. Justin Akadonye reports that the forum brought together architects and other professionals to share thoughts on the theme, the city of Lagos, what is Lagos? Details in this report. Lagos is the fourth capital of Nigeria, known for its uniqueness as an economic hub, high-flying business hub, and a city that has long captivated people from all over the world. However, these architects have converged to share ideas and critical insights to effectively midwife a livable and sustainable Lagos state. We try to analyze the physical developments within the city of Lagos and see how we can get government to uh, key into some of the uh, suggestions that uh, as professionals we think they should uh, key into. When we talk of the thriving city in the world. These are cities that never sleep. What it is all about is to synergize, to interact with the private sector, the public sector, the manufacturers, the suppliers of building uh, materials. In recent times, incidences of building collapses have become recurring, even with a city as commercial as Lagos. As one wonders how this tide can be stemmed, government is advised to ensure monitoring as enforcement does not stop when approval is given. The professionals believe that state government should domesticate a national building code as well as show political will to stop the menace. The building code actually has some compliance forms built into uh, the document such that at various stages of the development of the building of the, uh, of the building, you have relevant professionals signing off at different stages. Are we shying away from our responsibilities? Are we ready to take up our responsibilities? And to be honest with you, please be ready for more collapses. Because if we are not ready to do the right thing, then be sure that these uh, 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 tragedies will continue to occur. Until we can have a proper governance structure on the construction process, where we start to track who designs, who supervises, what are the stages of construction, what are the stages of certification, and it's available on a digital platform. This is why this is Lagos. The NIA shows that it will continue in its advocacy role as watchdogs to promote best practices in the building procurement process to avert ugly consequences of building failures and collapses. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.